Hey loves, welcome back to another video. I'm Winner J and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. tell by today's title I'm gonna be doing the long awaited what's in my bag video and I'm basically just gonna be sharing with you guys everything that I carry in my purse my day-to-day -day necessities or even just little extra miscellaneous items that I carry that I think will be good for you guys to carry as well I cannot wait to show you guys everything that I carry in my bag honestly don't judge okay there may be some items where you be like girl how do you even fit that in your everyday bag but keep in mind before we get into to this video that everything that I do keep in here it's gonna be obvious that it can't fit in every size purse but keep in mind that although I do not wear this bag with like every outfit this bag is always with me so whether it's in my trunk whether it's in you know my back seat wherever it's always with me because it always has everything that I need so without further ado let's get right into it first and foremost the bag that I do carry often is my MCM um medium size liz reversible i think that's the name of it i hope i'm right y'all but i will try to link it down below in the description box so you guys know exactly which one this is but the first thing that i keep is okay i'm gonna just show you guys this thing first because it's big so the first thing that i keep is a water bottle um i got this water bottle from target y'all can see it is clearly bulky so if i don't carry this one then i'll have like a regular water bottle or just some type of like juice basically something to drink like i have to have something to drink with me because my mouth be getting dry sometimes and especially when i eat food so yeah i have to make sure that i have something to drink with me so i recommend everybody making sure y'all bring anything to drink whether it's a water bottle y'all carry every day or whether it's just you know you going out and buying something just make sure y'all have it the next thing I keep is of course my keys of course this is only when I'm not driving but you know majority of the time when I do have this purse I am driving so um but pretty much I just have like this I don't even know what you call this but we just gonna say a keychain I got this from Victoria's Secret I got this a while ago actually I need to get another one um maybe like the black one or something but yeah and then of course I have the two keys that goes to my car and I have these two little Kroger things <laughs> and I have my house key and I don't even know what these two keys are for y'all honestly I forgot but yeah I try not to oh and then I have my hand sanitizer I got this from Bath and Body Works so I try not to keep too much stuff on my key ring because I heard that if you have too much stuff it can like mess up your what do you call it <laughs> it can mess up basically like your steering wheel whenever you stick it in and your key will start like hanging if it's too much on there so yeah <laughs> the next thing I keep is of course some perfume you guys I don't go anywhere without bringing whatever perfume I'm wearing for that day so it don't always be this one this one is the Burberry her and you guys may have seen this one in my vanity tour um if you watched that one already but if you have not make sure you guys go and check that video out but this is my top favorite perfume so I do carry this one often yeah I run through these bottles like crazy so I really love this one but you always gotta you know make sure you can touch up and smelling good all the time we love to see it so yeah the next thing I have is my tripod stand this is actually for my camera and right now my camera is sitting on my room um tripod stands but normally it does sit on this one for when I vlog and like when I take my camera almost everywhere I go now so um this is basically always with me as well so make sure you guys if you are a youtuber or if you you know just like recording or whatever then I would say get you a nice you know small compact little tripod stand that you can carry around easily and it's very convenient <laughs> the next thing I have is this power bank um, I got this from Verizon it's pink so y'all know I love everything like light pink new all of that so this is a nice little thing to have um, for when you are in like places or areas where you can't plug up your phone um, and use your actual um, like charger then you can easily use this to charge your phone on the go so I would recommend everybody get a good power bank 
this one was a little bit expensive from Verizon you don't have to really get one that's too expensive I just got one because I literally was doing an interview for Verizon one day and it caught my eye so I picked it up the next thing that I have are my airpods um at first I actually carried my airpods on my key ring but I kept like losing them or like the case would open and I've had to buy so many new pairs of airpods because I they would always co come up missing from me keeping them on my key ring so I just took them out and I basically always have these I also keep my beats in here I have the rose gold beats and honestly i use my airpods more than anything you guys like i really use my beats for when i go to the gym or like just for some reason if my airpods are not charged or if i forget them or something then i always make sure i carry this as a backup um so yeah it's really nothing special about these two <laughs> the next thing i have in here is this little piece honestly y'all i don't even know what to call this i guess you could say a type c sd reader and this is basically for my computer because i do have the macbook pro um 16 inch and if you guys have that one then you know that they don't have like the regular plugins as a lot of other computers do so I basically um, have this so that I can put my SD card for my camera and pretty much transfer everything on my camera to my computer so I just keep this with me because y'all would be surprised what I end up showing y'all later on in the video so just keep on watching so the next thing I keep is my birth control pills and honestly you guys like I at first I would keep my birth control pills like in my room in this little dresser thing that I have next to my bed but I started slacking and like not taking them at the same time um I do take them every day you know so I just thought it would be better to keep them in my purse because you know I have all this other stuff that I need to get out my purse every day so I just thought it would be more convenient and helpful for me to be able to remember to take my pills um so yeah <laughs> the next thing i have of course is my phone um i have the iphone 13 pro max so of course right now i'm recording on my camera so my phone um i don't go anywhere without my phone i'm sure nobody goes anywhere without their phone but sorry <laughs> okay so yeah that's what i keep and then of course i have to keep my charger i don't know i mean i i use my phone kind of all day if that makes sense but for some reason i don't find myself having to use my charger as much like during the day i would say my battery it lasts pretty good so but i'm pretty sure this is like not any new new news to anybody like everybody knows you got to bring a charger no matter where you go so the next thing i keep is my hard drive and this is we all know what this is i'm sure um this goes plugged into my computer or when i am trying to like save you know things for my camera and I don't want to put it all just on my computer so I have this as like a backup extra storage so I mean it's pretty self-explanatory the next thing is I have this cute little pink like pill case and I got this off of Amazon um honestly I would recommend anybody to get to get this because it's really convenient like as far as helping you to remember to take your vitamins I mean if you take vitamins pretty much what I have in here is and it's small it's really compact um you can pretty much fit it into any purse but so far I just have I'm not sure if you guys can see it but I just have some toothpicks right here I have like Tylenol PM regular Tylenol and melatonin so of course when I get home like I'll put my purse on my clothing rack and it's right next to my bed so you know if I ever need help with like getting some sleep pop a melatonin in and we're good the next thing I keep of course is my little wallet um don't laugh at me y'all but y'all can I don't know if y'all can see it if y'all can tell but like the bottom the dirty is like messing up I got this cheap little wallet from Walmart I pretty much keep just like my little cards in here whatever cash that I have on hand and um just like a little bit of change I don't really try to keep too much change in here because I also have my little coin pouch and this pretty much carries all of my coins and then inside of this I have this other little coin pouch I got this from the beauty supply store and I got this from Victoria's Secret a very long time ago so that's pretty much what I keep in these two so yeah I do want to get another one though I've been having my eye on like a Louis Vuitton wallet 
or this Burberry wallet. I don't know. I haven't decided which one I want to get yet. So for right now, this one is going to do. So then the next thing that I have are, well, let me just grab all of them so y'all can see. Don't think I'm crazy for having this many on me, but if you know, you know. The next thing that I keep are these lip glosses. Um, this one is She's Unapologetic, and I actually have this one on right now. Um, this is by Patrick T.A. I have this lip butter. This is like my favorite thing to put on my lips, like whenever I am, you know, like if I don't have on any makeup or if I just want to make sure that my lips stay moisturized then this is pretty much the first thing that I go to or I use this chapstick um lip balm by artistry studio and then I have the Rihanna Fenty and Mauve Wives uh lip cream this one is really really cute so I would say go get that one the next one I have is the hangover pillow balm by Too Faced and I think I actually got this from Target in the little Ulta section that they have in the Target that I go to. And then the last one I have is the Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss and Fussy. This is the very first lip gloss that I got when Rihanna, you know, came out with her brand. And I fell in love with it. I've had so many of these over the years. So I always have to have at least one of these on me then lastly i have the Too faced lip injection in extreme this is what i use like no matter what like whenever i do my makeup no matter what lip gloss or whatever i use i always make sure i put this on top because this is a lip plumper so it just kind of gives you know you that extra mm, <laughs> to your lip gloss so i really like this um, it does tingle a little bit so if you're not used to that or if you if it causes you to be a little bit uncomfortable then I would say just take it off and discontinue use and then of course I have these lip liners this one this one is a lip liner but I use it for like the middle of my my lip combo sometimes um, I don't really use it as a lip liner I more so use it as like a lipstick and then I have this auto lip liner by Ruby Kisses in the color Coco. And I actually just picked this one up at the beauty spy store and I fell in love with it. I feel like it's the perfect brown. I have a few actually that I use. And if you guys checked out my last, well, my first makeup tutorial video, that was a fail. Okay. It honestly was a fail. As you guys can tell, I'm sure you probably can tell, I've gotten a whole lot better and I have actually mastered learning how to do my face. So I'm going to be dropping a new and updated makeup tutorial very soon. So be on the lookout for that. But yeah, these two I pretty much carry with me or just any brown lip liner, I would say, because y'all know our favorite lip combos is a brown liner and some type of like pink or bright looking lip part. So yeah, the next thing I keep, of course, something simple is my contact lens case for those of you who don't know i am blind okay i wear glasses but y'all will probably never see me in my glasses or would rarely see me in my glasses because most of the time i am wearing my contacts the next thing i keep in here is a rat tail comb and i actually keep a brush like a um like a paddle brush in my purse as well but i can't find the little mini one that i had so for right now i just have this rat tail comb i mean i'm sure all my girls we know what i have this for to make sure that if i need to touch my hair up a little bit or whatever then i can do that and then i have this edge wrap for when i have in my frontals um and i just want to make sure that you know it's laid down if you know you know i keep two scrunchies in here right now it only has one but normally i keep two um because you just you just never know and i feel like these things come up missing so quickly and so easily and if you guys checked out the vanity tour video again then you remember I have a whole drawer with like different size scrunchies and it's like a lot. So I definitely do buy these in bulk because they always come up missing. Next thing I have is of course I have to keep some gum on hand. This was just a three pack of like a mega pack of gum. So this is actually my favorite one. It's in the flavor Polar Ice. If y'all know, y'all know. And then last but not least, at least for right now, um, I do have other things that normally I keep in my purse, but I just switch purses. So yeah, we're just going to leave it where it's at. The last thing that I keep in here is this little compact journal. It says, let's take this offline on the front of it. Basically this is just really like it really does come in handy and i got this from target i don't know if y'all can see it but 
I got this from Target. Um, you can get one anywhere like Ross, Target, Walmart, just, you know, wherever. And I'm sure we all know what this is for. Like, this helps me stay organized. Honestly, you guys, I don't. At first, I didn't use it as much because I was the type of person that if I seen something cute in the store and I just thought it looked nice, I would spend my money on it even though I didn't need it. So, over the years, I've literally accumulated so many journals and planners and things and honestly haven't used half of them. But I have changed that little habit. So, I have limited myself to just one journal like I said it helps me stay organized and just kind of plan my day my days out so I would recommend everyone to get one of these before I forget so this is the small bag that came with this purse um I got this purse from the MCM store and this is the one that came with it so I actually love this little bag I feel like it's the perfect size for if you want something smaller or if you don't want to carry the bigger one which this is the medium size one if you guys compare this one to the large one in the store the large one literally looks like a big duffel bag so I'm so glad that I got the medium one and this one came with it and so um if i am carrying this one then in the inside i just got this little um purse organizer from shein and i actually need to order like a bigger one that fits this purse because listen i be getting overwhelmed sometimes when my stuff be everywhere and i be searching for it versus having a purse organizer where it's easily to organize things in my purse and just pull it out when i need to okay so last but not least and this is not all the time but it's a lot of the time because I do use my computer a lot since I am in school but I keep my computer in here and I will show you guys how it fits and you know let you guys know that it does fit I do have to be careful because this computer is really heavy you guys like if you've never carried or held um, this computer I would suggest go to the store hold it all of that like yeah this is not like the smaller ones where you can easily just put it in like a smaller bag and just go I have to make sure I carry some type of like tote bag specifically for this which is why I also made this kind of like my everyday bag but yeah so on the days that I bring this you guys see it fits pretty perfectly in here I mean it's not too heavy but it can definitely get a little heavy yeah you guys that's basically everything that I keep in my purse so far sometimes if I'm wearing my jewelry or then I have a habit of like putting my box to my watch in here or something like that but for the most part that's basically everything that I keep and then of course my camera um, when I'm not using it I do keep it in my purse as well I hope you guys enjoyed this video I enjoyed filming it for you guys and just sharing with you what all I keep and hopefully I gave you guys some ideas of what you can go out and get just to pick up and keep in your purse but yeah you guys if you have not done so already make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel make sure you guys join the family i'm super excited and i cannot wait for you guys to grow with me with all of that being said thank you guys so much for tuning in be on the lookout for the next video and i'll see you guys next time yeah.